Aladdin. Three cheesy wishes. Long ago, before there was an Aladdin, a Jasmine, or even a Sultan, the magic lamp was making its way towards the Cave of Wonders, where Aladdin would one day find it. A travelling merchant had bought the lamp, along with some other junk. Not knowing its value, he sold it to a cheese seller for some lunch. Hassan, the cheese seller, looked at the lamp skeptically. He sighed, and began to shine it up. In a puff of smoke, the genie appeared. Hello there. I'm the one and only magical genie. The big blue spirit announced. Excuse me," said Hassan. "Nice to meet you," said the genie. "And what do you do here in Agraba?" "My name is Hassan, and I'm a..." "Wait!" cried the genie. "Let me guess. They say I'm a little psychic, you know." The genie put his hand over his brow as he secretly looked around the man's shop. "You sell cheese." Am I right, or am I right? You are right," said Hassan. "But that's an easy guess, not very magical." "You're very observant, Hassan," said the genie. "So I'll give you three wishes." Three wishes, eh?" Hassan thought for a few minutes. Then he said, "It's hard to get enough good milk to make the best cheese. I wish I had many." Many goats, so I would always have enough milk. Poof! In a flash, thousands of goats filled the streets of Agraba. Goats were everywhere. They crowded the little shop, and knocked over the stalls in the market. Goodness! Hassan cried. I would have to wish for the biggest cheese shop in the world to sell the cheese from so many goats. Poof! All of a sudden, Hassan's store began to grow and grow. His cheese shop was even taller than the highest sand dunes outside the city. This is terrible! Hassan cried. Far below, the people looked like tiny ants. I can't live and work in such a monstrosity. All I wanted was to make the finest cheese in Agraba. Hassan turned to the genie. "I wish I'd never met you," he cried. "Poof!" Suddenly, the genie was gone. Hassan found his shop back to normal. Outside, the marketplace was completely goat-free. Hassan searched high and low for the lamp, but it was already tucked into a little boy's pocket. Where would it end up next? It must have all been a crazy dream," said Hassan. But from that day, everyone said Hassan's cheese was the finest in all of Agraba.